Welcome to our exciting video. On this occasion, we will explore the fascinating world of free TV antennas. We will discover how a simple coaxial cable can open the doors to all free television channels. Get ready to dive into the magic of unrestricted television. Don't miss this fascinating video and discover the power you have in your hands to unlock a plethora of free channels. Let's get started. Step 1. Gather the materials. Make sure you have a 1.5 meter coaxial cable, a coaxial cable connector, and coil wire on hand. Step 2. Mark Mark 60 cm on the coaxial cable use a ruler or measuring tape to measure 60 cm from one end of the coaxial cable. Clearly mark this point. Step 3. Remove the excess from the coaxial cable with the help of pliers. Carefully cut the coaxial cable at the marked point to obtain a length of 60 centimeters. Remove the excess, including the black rubber, mesh, and dielectric to expose the inner conductor of the coaxial cable. Ready. You have now completed the first part of the process. At this point, you have a 60 cm coaxial cable ready to proceed with the next stages of your project. Step 4. Additional preparation of the coaxial cable measure 1 cm from the cut end. Using a ruler, measure 1 cm from the cut end of the coaxial cable. Clearly mark this point to ensure accuracy. Remove the black rubber. With great care, use pliers to remove the layer of black rubber at the marked point. Be sure not to damage the internal components of the cable. Wrap the mesh backward by 0.5 cm. After removing the rubber, wrap the metal mesh backward, covering 0.5 cm of the dielectric and the inner conductor. This this will help prepare the connection for the next step. Wind the 1mm copper wire. Take the 1mm copper wire and wind it around the exposed mesh. Step 5. Adjustment and additional preparation of the coaxial cable measure 13.4 cm from the tip of the dielectric backward. Using a ruler, measure 13.4 cm from the tip of the dielectric backward on the coaxial cable. Mark this point to indicate the location. Mark 1 cm backward from the measured point. From the point marked in the previous step, measure 1 cm backward and make another mark. This will be crucial for the next stage of the process. Cut to remove the black rubber. With caution, cut the coaxial cable at the mark made in the previous step. This cut will allow you to remove the black rubber and expose the internal part of the cable. Repeat step 4. Once you have removed the black rubber, repeat step 4. Measure 1 cm from the new cut end. Remove the black rubber. Wrap the mesh backward by 0.5 cm and wind the 1 mm copper wire around the exposed mesh. By following these additional steps, you'll be adjusting and enhancing the coaxial cable to optimize its performance in building your TV antenna. Proceed with your project. Step 6. Preparation of an additional section of the coaxial cable measure 2 cm from the newly prepared end. Using a ruler, measure 2 cm from the newly prepared end of the coaxial cable. Mark this point to ensure accuracy in the process. Remove the black rubber, mesh, and dielectric. With extreme care, use pliers to remove the layer of black rubber, the metal mesh, and the dielectric at the marked point. This step will expose 2 cm of bare cable. Confirm 2 cm of bare cable. After removing the layers, you should have 2 cm centimeters of bare coaxial cable. Ensure that the exposure is even and without damage to the internal components. This step adds a specific section of bare cable that will be essential for the next phase of building your TV antenna. Proceed with the next step of your project and you'll be closer to completing your customized antenna. Step 7. Mark 1 centimeter of cable and repeat step 5. Mark 1 centimeter from the cable end. Using a ruler, measure 1 centimeter from the end of the coaxial cable and mark this point for reference. Repeat step 5. Following the instructions 
instructions from step 5. Perform the necessary actions again. Measure, cut, remove the black rubber, wrap the mesh backward by 0.5 cm, and wind the 1 mm copper wire around the exposed mesh. Continue with the process. Once the step is completed, proceed with the overall process of building your TV antenna. This additional step will contribute to adjusting and improving the performance of the coaxial cable in your project. Carry on with your project and enjoy the construction of your personalized antenna. Step 8. Installation of the Type F connector for RG6 coaxial cable on the opposite side. Preparation of the cable end. Ensure that the cable end is clean and free of residues. Select the Type F connector. Choose a Type F connector for RG6 with an inner thread. Slide the connector onto the cable. Insert the cable end into the Type F connector. Tighten the connector. Rotate the connector clockwise to secure it to the cable. Use a wrench if necessary, without over-tightening. Visual verification. Visually confirm that the connector is securely attached and without exposed copper wires. With these steps, you have installed the Type F connector on the opposite side of the RG6 coaxial cable, ready to be used in your TV antenna project. Step 9. Creating a loop ballon for impedance matching Fold the 2 cm section in half. Take the coaxial cable and fold the 2 cm section in half. Ensure that the fold is even and precise. Fold the coaxial cable. Continue folding the coaxial cable, joining it at the point where the 0.5 cm wire wrapped sections are located. You will form a U-shaped structure with a folded section. Join the three segments with wire. Securely fasten the three segments that have the 0.5 cm wire wrapped sections. Then, take a piece of wire and firmly bind it around the three segments to create a loop ballon. Impedance adjustment. This loop ballon will help adjust the antenna's impedance from 300 to 75 ohms. Ensure that the connections are tight for efficient signal transmission. With these steps, you have created a loop ballon to adjust the impedance of your TV antenna. This component is essential for optimizing the performance of your antenna. Proceed successfully with your project. Step 10. Building the dipole for the UHD Ultra High Definition Antenna from 470 MHz. Fold the inner conductor 1 cm. At the cable end, fold the inner conductor backward at a distance of 1 cm. This creates the starting point for building the dipole. Mark and fold 11.2 cm from the starting point, measure 11.2 cm and mark this point. Then, fold the cable at that point to form the first section of the dipole. Continue with 6 cm and fold 90 degrees. From the last folding point, measure 6 cm and make another 90 degree fold at a right angle to the previous section. Continue with 23.4 cm, fold 90 degrees, and form a rectangle. Measure 23.4 cm from the last fold, make another 90 degree fold, and continue folding the cable to form a rectangle with the previous sections. Add 6 cm and fold 90 degrees. After the rectangle, measure 6 cm and make a new 90 degree fold at a right angle. Close the rectangle. Continue folding the cable to close the rectangle formed earlier. Add 11.2 cm, measure, and fold the excess. From the last folding point, measure 11.2 cm and fold the excess of the cable backward. This end will be soldered to one of the outputs of the ballon.
Final result. After following these steps, you will have your dipole constructed with coaxial cable, optimized to operate in the UHD band from 470 MHz. Now, you can proceed to solder the end to the ballon to complete your antenna. Ready to enjoy high-definition broadcasting? Together, we've unlocked the door to an unrestricted television experience using a free antenna. The simple coaxial cable becomes our magical tool, allowing us to explore a world of TV channels without additional costs. This project is just the beginning of what we can achieve together. If you enjoyed... Un If you enjoyed uncovering the secrets behind this antenna and want to delve into more innovative RF antenna designs projects, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You'll stay updated on the latest trends in antenna design, practical tips, and exciting DIY projects that will enhance your TV experience. Subscribe now to not miss any updates. Together, we will continue exploring the fascinating world of antennas and unlock even more possibilities. Thank you for being part of the RF Antenna Designs community. See you in the next video.